I thought we did well. Uh, you know, traditionally, um, we don't do real well, real well versus Wisconsin. You know, um, uh, since the time I was getting recruited here, I remember 2015, uh, I mean 2014, and, and watching, you know, how, you know, those running backs ran against us in the years and years and years. I think today we did a good job in containing those running backs. Uh, a lot of push the power plays where the linemen assisted the running back and you know drove de- drove the you know tackler back as well as the running back. Um, I think we did a good job in um, our running defense. Uh, we just need it was just critical downs in the defense where we needed to make a play, and, and we did it. You know, and that's that was the big part of the game is you got to make those critical plays when you're facing a top 25 team, and that's what happened. We did it. Mo, uh, you were leading 14 to 10, but then they run off 24 straight points. Uh, were they doing anything with success that you saw during that period of time? What were they doing? Um, I think it just it's bad. You know, the momentum from the kickoff return, everyone knows that. Um, that's, you know, sometimes I guess is emotional imbalance when that happens. Uh, guys know traditionally, you know, we get whipped by this team and maybe it's like a kind of, oh, snap, here we go. We got them, you know, in the first quarter, this is about go downhill, but then we we, we bounce back from that. And uh, that was the, that's what I was proud of today. I felt like our team grew today. This is a good team, good defense, good offense, and I think we played our part. We played well. In, in this game, you know, uh, we found ways again to beat ourselves instead of getting dominated, and um, and we and we competed to the highest level, and uh, we could have won that game. Everyone know to the to the to two minutes in the in the fourth quarter, we could have won that game, and um, we didn't. Well, last year, you kind of said the same thing to us at Ohio State. This game reminded you a little bit of that, like yeah. you're so close, and yet what, what's yeah. missing. Yeah, that's crazy. It does remind me of that game. Um, Ohio State, we had the lead going into the to halftime. And um, this game, it just it felt like, you know, I, if you watch the game, if you're in the game, you feel like we could win this game. You know, and the entire time, that's what I was feeling. That's what I thought would happen. Um, again, you know, we have to win all three phases. We have to make critical plays in all three phases, and we can't let them um, beat us in all three phases. And that's the biggest thing. Um, you know, they made mistakes. We mis- made mistakes. We just got to figure out a way in critical moments to, to win. And that's that's what we have to do. But then again, this is a great team, and we competed with them. What's the vibe right now on defense? We guys have two starters out today with injuries. And, um, you know, a couple other guys banged up. What, what, where's you guys' mood right now as a, as a unit? I think people dialed in, you know. I think uh, I think that I didn't feel a difference in uh, the energy. I felt like people was more focused in this game than Purdue game. I don't know it's because we're in Memorial Stadium, best place to play. Uh, I don't know what it is. I felt the the focus. I felt the the energy. Um, and again, this team they could lower you to sleep and then like destroy you if you let them. And, and we we didn't let our will be broke. And and it was. That's why I'm proud of my defense today uh, and my team. Um, we had a lot of naysayers in these two weeks. We had a lot of criticism in these two weeks. Well, we could have just came there. They could have got the lead, and we could have just broke down like the teams in the past did, and we didn't. Do you think players on defense specifically were playing just a little more free in this game compared to previous weeks? Yeah, yeah, and that's a good point. I, I felt like people was playing free. I could, um, you know, I, I, I could feel the energy. Like I said, it's been a long time since I truly felt it. Um, I felt for myself that I played free this game, that that I was flying around, that um, I understood that it, even the greatest players make mistakes at, on one down and um, just make more plays than you make mistakes and make it critical play, make the critical plays. And uh, I think that's what a lot of players were doing. And um, like you said, as a spectator, uh, that's what I felt also. 
else from up? There's a lot of young guys on the defensive line playing in front of you. A lot of guys can play. From your vantage point, from what you can tell, what did you think of the way that Ty Robinson, Keen Green, and Casey Rogers, those guys played? Oh, they did a good job. Um, I didn't notice a difference out there when they were there because uh, they did their, their part. Uh, the biggest thing was us communicating to them when they got loud in our stadium, uh, going down there and making sure they bump over and make sure they're in their proper gaps. That's how we helped them out. But they did a real good job. Ty, Ty Robinson, as y'all know, going to be a good player, and King Green also. So, you know, it was a good game by them, and I didn't even notice the difference between them and the starters. Uh, of course, you know, Los is a dominant player, and I'm not taking none away from him and Darian. But they did a good job in uh, filling in. Oh, one well, last one. You need to win two more games more. to go to a bowl game for your senior year. What's your message to your teammates? Um, you know, I think what I have to say is going to be to them. Um, you know, for a long time, I, I just feel like, you know, saying stuff to the media doesn't really, you know, matter in the great scheme of things if I don't get it across the entire team. And that's what I'm really focused on. But as y'all, for everyone out there, uh, we grew up in this game. You know, it, it, it's easy to say that we could have got destroyed by Wisconsin. Like everyone predicted, it's easy to say that we could have, we just could have laid down, let let number um, 23 just run down our throat, and we didn't. And we competed. We could have won that game. We found a way to beat ourselves. And these next two games, we're gonna compete just like that, and we're gonna win them. Thank you, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.